Shalom. Before I begin this video, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai. And I want to give double honors to the apostles and Elders of Great Millstone that can tell the rule well. And um, Shalom to the hopefully elect that's um, also pushing this word on the four corners of the earth in our faith, truth, and sincerity, and giving all diligence. Now, um, the topic of this video is um, going to be centered around the name of whom these people in really call Jesus and Christ and um, they in really call the Heavenly Father um, as God or Yahweh or whatever they want to call him because see we're coming to a time to where it's going to get rough out here man I mean you can clearly see in the um, the news outlet that the face of terrorism now they're putting us on that label us being um you know so called negro suspense and native americans you know and, and they've been um pushing that that vibration out saying that you know pretty much with terrorists and really they're um trying to put our faces us being the men of the lord that's doing his work you know, they putting our faces on on that um that on that um that list, so to speak. So, once again, like I said before, we're gonna come into some heavy times, and and you know this is, this this topic in general, you know, is very important because uh, during that time, it's gonna be a time of great faith and the reliance on. Whom the, these people literally call God, you know, Yahweh. His name is Yahweh, and um, his son's name is uh, Yahweh Shai, whom they literally call Jesus in Christ. And see, there's also another scripture in the Book of Proverbs, chapter one, where it says, uh, "These people, when when their calamity fall upon them, they're gonna call on the Lord." But he's not going to answer because, you know, these these uh these Israelites that's in the world, and it's also part of the um, this world too, man. The one that's you know call themselves Israelites, you know, going out, or or, or, or you know I, I can't even say that now because they don't they don't even go out anymore, man. They they might show up like maybe well once a month maybe. All right, and by and the ones who I'm talking about, you know, it's pretty much the the heads of uh, IUIC, you know, and um, and the head of ISUPK. All right, and there's and and there's others that that um that don't go out anymore. You know, now they want to pick a perfect type of weather to, to go out and um, do the work. And see, the thing is, man, even even if they call even even if they call on the name of Yahweh, why Yahweh Shai, that still wouldn't be able to deliver them, man. And the scriptures say, even, um, even them that's, that, that, uh, that says, Lord, Lord, shall not enter into the kingdom. Why is that? Because they haven't did what was pleasing to the Most High. They haven't done the things that they were supposed to be doing. They weren't standing on their watch and they weren't doing the work. So when that time comes, once they call on the Lord to help them out, then the Lord's not gonna help them out. Why is that? Because they haven't helped out the Lord. I mean, it's 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 a perfect balance, man. All right, you do something for your how about Shimon Shai, and your how about Shimon Shai is gonna do something for you. I mean, that's um, that's that's a, that's a give and take, man. That's that's pretty much, you know, and that's that's a fair balance, man. All right, you sow good, you're gonna reap good, man. I mean, that's that's common sense. But um, not to stray too far off the topic, man. You know the name of the Lord is is as uh, like the scriptures say right here in front of me is as a strong tower. All right, so when that time comes, you know we have to pretty much fall back on the name the names Yahweh, where Yahweh Shai. All right, and even even in uh, prayer, you know, because if if you claim that we still don't know the name of the Heavenly Father and the Son, then 
you know, then who 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 are you praying to? You know? Because when you're a part of this thing of ours, yeah, you have to, you have to make prayers and supplications. So who are you praying to? You know, that's the question that that we ask them. And we still to this day haven't gotten an answer yet. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and read this precept, which is um topic is based on this uh, Proverbs chapter 18, verse 10. And it reads the name of the Lord, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, is a strong tower. The righteous running into it and it's safe. You see, the righteous running into that name, man. All right. The righteous running into that name and, and they're safe because we have full reliance. And we have and in other words, we have full faith on the name of Yahweh, Yahweh Shai, man. All right. That's why it says the name of Yahweh about Shemuel Shai is a strong tower, man. But that's only to the ones who have faith in that name. All right. Because um, you might have a person that may know the name of Yahweh about Shemuel Shai, but they don't have no faith. All right. And see, when you have faith, like the scriptures say, if you have faith, then your works will follow. All right, see these guys that claim themselves to be Israelites, they, they lost the faith because they stopped going out and doing the work. All right. And see that and that's pretty much the whole topic of the video, just to show you that uh the name of Yahweh about Shemuel Shai is, is is very important, you know, especially in this in this thing of ours. Because um whenever there was a downfall of any kingdom, the name of the Lord is always magnified, especially during the time of the Egyptians. Uh, when uh, the Lord called Moses to lead the children of Israel out of the land of Egypt. Um, he published the name, and they knew who, who what power they were working with. And see, that's the same thing today. They know what power they were working with. They know we, they know they were working with the power of Yahweh by Shimei All right. So with that, man, uh, hopefully y'all can be edified. And um, till next time, want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Shimei All Double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that continually rule well. And um, Shalom and peace and safety to the Hopeful Lick that's also uh, doing the work in our faith, true and sincerity, and giving our diligence. And with that, I'm going to say Shalom.